Why are you doing this? Why? Well, because I'm an incredible dancer, and it would be a shame not to share my talent with the world. <laughs> nope. Don't worry. I didn't see you smile. Miss Mystic Falls. First time we ever danced. Stepin stood you up. Bloodlust issues. Surprise, surprise. So I stepped in. You're trying to stir up memories. This isn't a good idea. I stepped in. Sexy as hell and saved you from complete and utter humiliation. Of course you were just worried about Stefan, but there was this moment, this one moment, where everyone else fell away. It was just the two of us. Look, I'm here with someone. Damn, you can't just come unannounced and, and ruin my night. Come unannounced? What are you talking about? I literally went through time and space to be with you. I know. It. Look, do you, do you want me to feel guilty? Because trust me, Damon, I do, okay? I feel horrible, and I, I'm sorry, but I don't... I don't know what to tell you. What do you want me to say? I don't remember us. I do. And no matter how much I missed you or how much pain I was in, I never would have erased everything we ever had. Even if I was drowning in grief, I'd rather hang on to every moment that I ever held you or every laugh that I ever heard, every shred of happiness that we ever had. I would rather spend every moment in agony than erase the memory of you. I need some hair. So that seems to be going well. Yeah. That's my fault. I shouldn't have compelled her. You shouldn't mix painkillers and booze. Whatever you did for Elena, that's her choice. Remember that. No pun intended. I am not on painkillers. In fact, I feel awful. But I am enjoying every miserable human moment of pain. To being powerless and mundane. Cheers. So, I guess we are both formally supernatural beings. Should we start a support group? <laughs> Well, technically, I relinquished my magic and put it away for safekeeping. I didn't know you could do that. Let's just say I chose to remove myself from a tragically dysfunctional family, and I haven't regretted a moment of it. Hey, who let you in? Oh, a radiologist I met at the gym. So what's the story with Tyler? It's a short story called Mind Your Own Business. Liv, I'm not saying don't have fun, hey, because that's why we're here. But when the coven calls us home... They don't care if we're in love or not. You sound like Dad, and that's not a compliment. Liv, have fun with your gym fling. Leave me to mine. 